Hey everyone, it's Mike here, and this is going to be a real quick video on my 2012 Nissan Maxima, how to aim the headlights. The question came from one of my subscribers, and uh, I can't really say which screw in the comments. You know, I can't really describe it too well, so here I'm just going to do a quick video. And you're going to see this is going to be a completely uncut video. You're not going to see any video editing tricks or anything like that mainly because of the fact that I don't have any video editing software right now. I was using the old YouTube one, but they got rid of that on September 20th, and that's why you guys haven't seen any new videos from me recently. You know, it's been a few weeks, and I've been working pretty tough on that, trying to figure out which video, video editing software I want to get. But So you will see a lot of videos coming. I'm backdated a lot, so working on that right now. Hopefully I have some more for you soon. Got a lot for the lawn care. And so back to the topic at hand. So my 2012 Nissan Maxima, how to, how to aim the headlights, all right? And, you know, if your headlights are too high or too low, you don't want that. If they're too high, you're going to be blinding people. If they're too low, you know, you're going to have poor vision at nighttime. So you want to find the right balance, you know. So you want to, I'd recommend putting it against the wall or your garage door and, you know, make sure that when you're, when you're aiming them, you don't want to do it this close, obviously, but... I'm just doing this for example, but you want to see, and you want to be even on both sides. Nice straight line, pretty much. You want to dry, draw across. All right, and you shouldn't have any issues with side to side. This is only going to adjust up and down. So if you have issues with side to side, then you have a, probably a loose screw on either on probably one of the other sides, either the inside screw or the or the the outside screw. You know, so you can mess with that yourself. But that's pretty rare. I mean, those are come standard. So here's where you adjust the uh, the driver's side. So if you look right in here, you should be able to see see that screw right there. Looks kind of gear-like in there. There's only one screw in here, so it should be pretty obvious, I hope. It's tough to get a good shot in there. There we go. You can see that see that gear in there. So that's what you want to turn. You want to get your screwdriver in there and just twist it and I can't do it because I don't have enough hands all right but this is the way to do it let me give it a quick try so okay can't do it don't have enough hands sorry but all you're gonna do is get it in, get your screwdriver in there flathead screwdriver and just turn a little bit just turn a little bit and I turn the other way. And it will take a decent amount of turns to get, you know, a result. You can only turn, what, one one turn each time you turn the screwdriver, pretty much. But, you know, play around with it, and that'll be your driver's side. Then for the other side, all you're going to do is pop off this panel here. And once you pop off this panel on the passenger side, all you have to do is pull it, pull it towards you. You have to pull it with a decent amount of force. But once you do, it's just a bunch of these, uh, try and show the best angle here. So you can see right here, it's just um, like slides. And they slide into these grooves like this. It slides into those grooves. So all you can do is pull them in and out of the grooves. And I probably recommend chain taking out this, uh, this push pin right here. So you'll see a push pin right there on top. So I'd take away that also. But, I mean, you can get to it without it. But again, same process here. In here, you're going to see their gear-like screw again. Surprise, surprise. There we go. And that's how you modify and aim the uh, passenger side headlight. All right. If you guys have any other questions, feel free to leave it in the comments, all right? Or if you want to see something different that maybe I didn't show already. All right. Thanks for watching.